I'm gonna show you how to fix your Ego string trimmer if the automatic uh, string trimmer feed is not working correctly. So I was pressing this button earlier and it was not feeding the head uh, correctly. So when you press this, it should go ahead and suck the string in and roll it up in the head and it wasn't doing that. So we're gonna take this apart and I can show you how to fix that. A few things you're gonna need is a standard screwdriver to pop the head off with. You're gonna need a socket wrench and a socket. This is a half inch socket. With these three things, we'll be able to take this apart. So let's go do that right now. All right, so I'm gonna talk to you guys about this problem. This is the uh, Ego Trimmer and it's not, uh, the self-feeding is not bringing in the string, as you can see. It's not bringing in the string into the trimmer head. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take this apart and we're gonna take a screwdriver here. Punch that out. Take a screwdriver and hit this side and pull this out. And pull this out here. There's a little spring in here. You do not want to lose this little spring. Pull this out here. Okay. Pull all this out and then we'll pull this string all the way out here. So that leaves this and we have a nut on here, and we're gonna go ahead and take this nut off of this shaft here. So let me go ahead and find that. On the bottom here, we're gonna to have to take off. I have a socket with a half inch. I'm gonna to have to go ahead and turn this counterclockwise. You have to hold it, I'm putting on a glove to hold it. And you can go ahead and take this off. Counterclockwise there. Whatever you do, don't lose this nut. And then this comes right off here. Also on the nut is a washer. So you got a washer and a nut. This comes right off here. I'll set this down. Take this out. A lot of times there's dirt, dust, and debris in here. I wanted to note while I was cleaning this out, I did not find a lot of dirt and debris in here. And when this gets a lot of dirt build up, this is what causes the problem. For some reason, by taking this apart and reinstalling it, it worked. But you need to make sure that you clean out all this dirt that's in here, if it is dirty. As you can see in this example, just by taking it apart, lightly cleaning it, I got it to work again. But again, there wasn't a lot of debris in here. And put your spring back in here, like so. And we're going to 
take this, line this back up in here. that and take our string this off a little bit to make us even and we're ready to go. Sounds good? Thanks.